The Little League World Series is underway, and baseball fans are happy to see the competition return to South Williamsport. Newswatch 16's Mackenzie Auker was on hand for today's opening ceremony. She joins us live from the Little League Complex. Mackenzie. Scott, the players aren't the only ones who have come far and wide for the Little League World Series. So did plenty of fans and families. Everyone here is looking forward to two weeks of baseball. It's just a, a great atmosphere here. Um, it's, uh, bring the kids. Uh, his, buddy, his buddies are going to come up here later today, and they can just run around, have a good time, take in some, some good games today. Everything's a beautiful day out here, and uh, just enjoy the festivities. Jim and Judah Rebilius travel to South Williamsport from Montgomery County every year for the Little League World Series. The father and son say it's awesome to not have to travel too far to take in all the action. I can um, come down here basically every year, not in a huge rush to get here all super fast, get here early, do whatever you want really. For Chuck Crickling, this is his first time coming to the Little League World Series. He's here to cheer on the Mid-Atlantic team from Newtown, which is just outside of Philadelphia. The most exciting is just seeing the kids here because I know that they're all Little League and playing and everything. They're excited to come out here and, and watch the kids play. So that'll be the highlight of it. But Crickling isn't the only one rooting for the Mid-Atlantic team. Dan and Kathy Gage's son and nephew both play for the team from Bucks County. This team is a little different than most teams in that it's been together for many, many, many years. It's not a, a typical all-star where they pick and, um, you know, there's a, a tremendous amount of talent in, in Newtown, uh, Pennsylvania. We've watched the Little League World Series on TV, uh, but there's nothing like standing here and looking out on this field and thinking, goodness, my boy and my nephew are going to be out on that field and we can't wait. Kathy Gage is right. There really is nothing like being here in person experiencing the Little League World Series for the first time. The Gages tell me they hope to stay here at the tournament until August 25th. Mackenzie Auker, Newswatch 16, live in South Williamsport. Okay.